What's up friends? We just finished a heavy arm workout, so we're going to do a full body stretch. We did some legs too in that last workout, so grab your mat, grab a towel, grab some water, and let's get started. We could untie our shoes in the hamstring stretch here. I'm feeling pretty warm, pretty loose right now. That's why I'm able to grab my toes, but don't grab your toes. If anything, grab the side of your foot. Pull your chest closer towards your body. Make sure when before you guys stretch, you guys get a good warm up in. I always use the reference of an elastic band. You put an elastic band in a fridge and you pull it out, stretch it, it's more likely to snap than if it was warm. Similar to your tendons and muscles, they're like elastic bands, they stretch and they contract. Let's switch legs, untie that shoe in this stretch. I don't even know if I'm in frame, but get that shoe off. Yes, Sam Smith, lead us with the cool down music. Toes point towards you, knee straight. Pulling yourself a little closer, chest closer towards your knee. Feet nice and stinky. Oh, I worked a full day. And then came to work out, and now we're here stretching. Let's come for a butterfly stretch. Amazingly good smelling feet. Holding your feet, pushing your thighs down with your elbows. Good. Stretching on our quads here. If you want a deeper stretch, come on your elbow. Some people like to lay flat on their back, but I'm scared if I do that, I won't be able to come back up. My quads are really tight. I'll just be laying here for the rest of the day, probably. All right, let that leg come back slowly. Switch. On your elbow if you want a deeper stretch or stay on your palm. <clears throat> I personally don't recommend, recommend laying flat on your back. <clears throat> Very good. Come up for a figure four. Stretch here. I'm going to go left foot over right knee or left ankle on top of right knee. Lean forward, get your butt off the ground for a deeper stretch, chest towards knee, toes pointing towards knee here, lock that kneecap. <clears throat> Man, I'm like staring right at this mosquito bite I got, and it looks like a bug like take a chunk out of my or something. Drop that knee, hug that knee. I thought it was a mosquito bite, but it might have been like a spider bite or something. Something that eats you, gets good chunks out of you. Um, opposite arm, opposite leg twist. Side glute stretch and uh, watch back stretch at the same time. All right, switching legs. Ooh, some more mosquito bites. Leaning forward, toes point towards knee. Nice and locked. Raptors are playing in five minutes. Oh, they're gonna warm up for like 20, 15. We'll be done by then, probably. Raptors in six. Calling in for the finals. Drop that leg, hug that knee. 
Maybe I'll put that bet in on, uh, online or something. If I can find it. Raptors to win the finals in six games. Probably against LA Lakers. Up his arm, up his leg, twist. Kit probably doesn't want to hear that. <laughs> Let's go Raptors. I'm hoping for that sweep against New York today. New York Nets. The most injured team in the league. Alright, let's stretch out our hamstrings real quick again. Probably one of my favorite stretches. I don't know why. Switch legs. Feels like... I do like stretching my quads too though. Let's come into a down dog, stretch up those calves, walk it up one by one. Coming into child's pose, stretching out those shoulders, leaning towards one side and then shifting your weight over, arm to arm. Taking your left arm, weaving it under, letting gravity do the stretch for you here. Back to center, child's pose, stretch right here. Switch arms, right arm under. Good, back to child's pose. Push up into Cobra. Chin nice and high. Taking your neck a bit here. Coming down. And push back up again. Chin nice and high. Down. Good, back to downward dog, walk up those calves. Probably one of the best ways to stretch out your calves without using a wall. All right, we're gonna take our left leg, swing it nice and high, and swing it through for a figure four. This is like a, I don't know if this is figure four. There's definitely a name for this, but we're stretching our side butt muscle in here. Let's call it mermaid stretch. I feel like a mermaid right now. A merman. A mer butler. I don't know. What is a male version of a mermaid? Unless mermaid is unisex. A unisex name. Reach it out if you like. <coughs> With your arms. Or you could have them on your hips. We definitely did a lot of side glute. Resistance exercise today, so this is a good stretch. Coming up, swing that leg back, downward dog, walk out those calves. We're gonna take our right leg, swing it up, and through. Into our mermaid pose. Patent pending. There, let's just roll over onto our backs. Hug those knee, hug that left knee. Closer towards your chest. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Pulling it towards your right, holding your left knee down with your right hand. Left arm open up. Gazing left, twist, lower back stretch, and butt stretch here. Oh, I think my cousin called this pigeon stretch or something. I don't know. I'm just going to call this laying on back butt stretch. 
Good. Back up. Left ankle on top of right knee. Weaving your hands in between that leg, our right knee, our right thigh, and pulling that leg towards us. Left toe pointed towards left knee, knee locked. We'll call this the shrimp stretch because I feel like I look like a shrimp right now in this position. We're just going to call things certain names. And then hopefully you guys just remember it and recall it that way. We're gonna call it shrimp stretch. Jumbo shrimp. All right, good. We're gonna take our right knee now, pull it towards us. We'll call this, I don't know, what do I look like right now? A fork. No, not a fork. I look at this mirror, this camera. What do I look like? I don't know. All right, let's go back to our side butt stretch on the ground slash pigeon stretch. Oh man, you know I could go for a good steak right now. We got some in the garage. Yes, that would be so good. Alright, legs back up. Oh, we're gonna go right over left. Right toes point towards right knee. Weave our hands in between for a jumbo shrimp. We could call this like pig in a blanket or something. Because our hands wrap around. Wait, no, that'd be like. No, maybe that works. Oh no, the next one's gonna be picking a blanket. Yes. The next stretch. So this is our shrimp. Alright, knees down. And then we're gonna hug our knees for a pig in a blanket. Yes. This is definitely a pig in a blanket. Kind of stretch. Because I'm the pig. Blanketed. Oh. All right, feet together, thighs pointing out. I don't know what this is called. Let's call this the keyhole stretch. Let gravity stretch out for you. All right, slowly coming to our side. Let's come back into a downward dog, stretch out our calves. We're gonna take our left leg, swing it up. Swing in between our arms. Windmill up to Warrior 2. We suddenly became a yoga class. From here, we're gonna pivot our back foot into our runners. And then lean forward. We're stretching our hip flexors here. Coming down, drop that back knee. Hips leaning more forward for a deeper stretch in our hip flexors. Now taking our right arm and reaching up to the side. Back the other way. Twisting slightly of the upper body slowly. Good. Hands up. Swing that leg back. Down dog. Right leg nice and high, swing in between. Windmill up to warrior two. Good. On the ball of our foot, on the back leg, stretch out our hip flexors here. Ooh. I thought that was a cramp coming. It scared me. Alright, dropping that back knee. Hips push forward. Flexor stretch here. Good. From there, hands down, legs come up. We're gonna come into a sumo. 
single stretch, I think. I don't know. Riding stance. Push your knees out with your elbows. You can rock side to side a little bit. Ew, what is this? Alright, from here, you have your hands down. Stretching your hamstring here. You could reach out towards your straight leg. You could be on the ball of your foot or flat footed. Up to you. Depends on your balance and flexibility. Let's come back to center again. Pushing out those knees. Now let's switch towards our right. Switch up here. Good. Back to center. Push up. We'll come up slowly to someone on the splits. Stretch out our shoulders here. A little tighter. Shake it out. Switch. How are y'all feeling? Nice and loose and stretched out, I hope. Good. Let's go left tricep. From here, holding that elbow, you can lean towards the side for a lat stretch and a tricep stretch. Good. Shake it out. Switch. Good. Find the wall. Let's stretch out our chest here. Ooh, I feel my keloid stretching. It's getting its own stretch to be nice and strong. Then I will someday surgically remove it. Switch sides. Good. Let's roll up those wrists. Hold on towards you. concludes our stretching class for today thank you guys for joining and hope to see you guys soon go wraps <laughs>